Okay. If you notice, oops, they're already building comb. I had to take that piece off where I left the frame out for the queen. They started building it out sideways. Um, I'm going to try to pull one out here so you can kind of see without uh, dropping the frame. Okay. Well, you can't really see, but uh, if you look, yeah, kind of like right there, uh, they've already started filling this frame with uh, comb. So you can see there's a lot of bees there. Um, so that's a good thing. Yeah, that was the frame falling apart. <laughs> but anyway, this is fresh comb. They built it where they weren't supposed to, so I got to squeeze in another, uh, another uh, frame. That frame literally fell apart. Yeah, so you really can't see too good down in there. But anyway, I don't want to lift it out. I got to add another frame. But anyway, so you can clearly see that they are already building uh, comb in there, so that's a good sign. Uh, it's only been a week. There, now they'll build it correctly. Uh, but anyway, see, this is what fresh comb looks like. I had to break this piece off. Uh, you can see there's already liquid in there. If you can see that, I'm not sure if you can see that. Uh, but they're already filling it up. I'll just leave this on top and uh, they'll collect it. But anyway, that's a good thing uh, that they're doing that already, so that's real good. Um, I had the space, I wasn't expecting that frame to fall apart. So that kind of sucks that the frame fell apart like that. The bees did not like that, but they're still okay. So anyway, yeah, so they're already, uh, they're already doing their job. This is a piece of uh, food, and you can see they've really uh, chewed away at it. Uh, they've eaten quite a bit of it. Um, so anyway, that's good. They're already building a frame, so it's only been a week, and they already have one frame, half of it filled, um, which is a good thing. And, uh, yeah, so the queen is already out. Her cage was empty, so she's in there somewhere. So uh, I know you can't really see very good in this video, uh, but I have to set this on a tripod so I can actually show you. But I just wanted to get a quick shot. They're already building comb. It's only been a week. That's because I added liquid food. Shit, maybe it was recording the whole time. Uh, I'm going to have to edit this video. I think it was on. But anyway, you can see uh, they're uh, buzzing around, you know, all over the place there. Um, yeah, I can't believe that frame broke like that. Pulled apart. Some of the frames are manufactured, and that would just happen to pull apart. And it's a frame covered with uh, comb, so the only thing I could do is uh, bring my electric nail gun out here. And uh, yeah, see, there's no way to lift that frame back out of there. Let's see if you can hear him buzzing. Oops, let me zoom out a little bit. There you go. So you can hear him buzzing. It's okay, guys. I didn't mean to drop you. All right. I won't get any closer. Of course, I'm pretty close as it is. But anyway, yeah, so I can't, I can't believe that. Oops, one just ran into me. But anyway, I can't. But anyway, you can see that the uh, hole, you know, right there that they're coming. Where's it at? Yeah, you can see that one there. Where's it at? Yeah, they're coming in and out of there quite a bit. And then I, I just opened this bottom further uh, to let them come and go. But yeah, a week, and they're already building a lot of comb. They already had a lot of comb building. So uh, that's a really, really good sign. But that's because I have liquid. Uh, feed in there, and then I have uh, uh, a patty in there, a protein patty, plus I have uh, the fake pollen in there. And um, even though we had three or four days and one night it went down to 26, but I did put a heater out here and had it blowing on the entrance, uh, which kept them warm, and then uh, within a day it warmed the uh, hive enough to where you could hear them in there working. So that's a real good sign. So the heater was worth running, especially when it dropped down to 26. I don't want to take a chance to lose any bees. Uh, the queen is out of her cage, which means she's running around in there. So she's probably already laying. But because that frame broke, 
pulled apart. I don't know if there's any other ones in there like that. Otherwise, I would uh, pull a frame out with comb on it so you can see what the eggs look like. But uh, next time I open it, I'll wait like two or three weeks and I'll open it again. And then I'll take a look at that and see. But yeah, they weren't too happy I dropped them. So. But the liquid food and the uh, pollen and that, you can see they're already filling the comb because see one, one piece dropped on the ground here. Uh, I don't think there's any bees on it. But you can see all the liquid that they'd already built up in there. Uh, and that's what they use, they dry it, and that's what makes honey. But this honey is for them, for the winter, so you don't touch your original honey. And, um, yeah, I don't see any eggs, I see some pollen there. But, uh, I don't see any eggs or anything. Uh, but this is brand new comb that they were building. Yeah, I don't see any eggs or anything in it yet. And, uh... The one frame, I can't believe they were building comb that quick, so unfortunately they lost this uh, comb here. But anyway, that's what fresh uh, comb looks like, as you can see. Uh, that liquid will be uh, turn out to be honey, so they're filling it pretty rapidly. I can't, you know, nope, this did have eggs in it. Um, not sure if you can... Damn it, I wish I had better... Um, those little white things that look like... Um, Piece of grains of rice. I'm trying to get the camera to angle right so you can see it. Um, in a way, they're very tiny.